Hi, this is Doug Ferber with American Feast, and I'm with uh, Astrid Bach Foster with uh, NSWG, the Napa Sustainable Wine Growers Group, and uh, Remy Cohen, who's the vineyard manager of Maryvale, a member of NSWIG, as they say. Astrid, why don't you start <clears throat> by telling us how NSWIG uh, started and what, what prompted the, uh, the formation of, of the organization and and we can go from there. Okay. Uh, NSWIG started about 12 years ago in 1995. It was just a couple of growers and one person from the Napa Resource Conservation District who got together with the idea to create um, a meeting point for local growers to come together and exchange ideas about sustainable farming practices and also to find a way to promote those ideas through meetings and seminars. So they started out really small, and then over the years we've grown to about 55 members now. And that's really where we're at. And we also have financial supporters, but our members are the most important part of the group because they help us promote the sustainable farming practices to local fellow growers. Is there a group like this in uh, the Central Coast or in Oregon or you know, France for that matter? Um, there are some uh, local organizations that are often meant to improve the quality of farming in other regions, and also sometimes they serve more as a marketing tool for them. I think that this is perhaps the one of the only um, organizations that's really just dedicated to educating the growers and improving quality and sustainability in the vineyard. But the Central Coast has the Central Coast Vineyard Team, and there are a lot of other wine-growing associations across across the world. But I think the Napa Sustainable Wine Growing Group is very special in that it is an information exchange and a collaboration among growers dedicated to making um, the vineyards more sustainable and higher quality. What percentage of the growers in Napa Valley are part of your organization? Oi. Um... I can't give you a percentage. I know we're, we're I, boy, I have the number online. Um, I want to... By the way, that's nswg.org, if you're curious. Yes. And I'm not at my own computer. I would look it up right now. Um, sorry, you could talk. I don't have the number. That's okay. You're, you're, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. This is my husband's computer here, and I'm trying to figure something out. Can you maybe just go on our website and go to the info page? <coughs> That's it right there, how many acres we represent. So the Napa Sustainable Wine Growing Group represents over 25,000 acres of farmed vineyard land and over 20,000 acres of unfarmed wild land as of March 2007. And that's actually a little bit over 50% of the planted acreage in the Napa Valley. There's about 45,000 acres of wine grapes planted in the Napa Valley.